Hello everyone, welcome. In this video, we are going to visualize our syllabus. Uh, that what topics we are going to cover in the playlist Python for beginners. So basically, there are ten chapters, and in ten chapters there are parts. I have divided each chapter into three to four parts so that it will be easy uh, to uh, to learn. So we we'll look to the first chapter. Uh, the first chapter is introduction to python and in the first chapter we'll cover basic syntax and data types then we'll cover variables and operators then we'll see the input and output operations in python that how uh, value should be taken from the input and how it should be printed then we'll see the control flow statements uh, like if else while loop for loops then we'll move to the second chapter that is will be based on data structure that how the data should be stored so for that we'll see the built-in functions of python that are list tuples and dictionaries then we will see uh, how to manipulate a string that what are the methods or functions present in a string and how to manipulate a string then we'll see the set and frozen set that what is sets and frozen sets then we'll use the numpy library for the arrays and matrix and we'll see how to install numpy library and import numpy library to for use to create arrays and matrices then we'll see the chapter 3 that are based that is based on functions and modules in this we are going to uh, learn how to define and call functions and how to pass and return values from the function and what is variable scope and lifetime then we will be introduced to modules and libraries that what are modules and libraries then in the fourth chapter will be based on file handling that in this chapter we are going to learn about reading from files writing to files working with text files and csv files then we are going to see file manipulation or an organization that what can what manipulation can be done on the files and then the organization then we'll move to the chapter 5 that is object oriented programming it is the most important chapter the oops concept in python so we'll see the principles of oops that are encapsulation inheritance polymorphism then we'll see the uh, how to create a class and objects then we'll see how to create the inside the class how to create attributes and methods then we'll see inheritance and method overriding uh, then in chapter 6 we'll read and learn about exception handling that is handling and raising exceptions if any error comes to how to handle that uh, using the try and accept blocks handling specific exception types of handling specific exceptions then what are the cleanup operations the finally block then in chapter 7 we'll see the advanced topics that are regular expressions working with date and times lambda functions decorators generators context managers and then in chapter 8 that is introduction to python libraries and frameworks in this chapter we are going to uh, learn about many libraries that are as follows numpy for numerical computing pandas for data manipulation and data analysis matplotlib for the data visualization that how to visualize that data in different graphs then for the web development we are going to see uh django or flask then for the machine learning we'll see tensorflow or pytorch these are very big big libraries we'll not see will not get that deep because this playlist is all about python for beginners so we'll we'll see the overview of uh, how these libraries are installed how this library can be important then we'll run two to three three programs of each libraries then how okay then in chapter nine we'll work on project and practical applications that how small scale projects can be implemented using python and applying python to real world scenarios then problem solving and how to think about if a question arises and how to think about the algorithmic uh, in an algorithmic way then at last in chapter 10 we'll see best practices and software developments that are uh, in which in this chapter we'll cover code organization and modularity then we'll see 
uh, how to do proper documentation and commenting in python then we'll see uh, debugging techniques then we'll see uh, version control and testing and test driven developments so after the completion of this uh, whole syllabus and the playlist uh, we will run python very deeply and very well so thank you we'll see you with the chapter 1 okay